hello everyone welcome back to another video of power bi so have you ever wondered how a bank application like mobile app or a web app uh, have this functionality like uh, to show or hide the balance and have you ever thought how easy or difficult is it to achieve that so in an application it is difficult it involves a lot of coding but in power bi it is pretty straightforward or simple uh, to achieve this uh, using the bookmarks in power bi so i have this uh, visual or the report created for today's demo so when i click on this little icon here it is going to show me the values on this visual this is a card visual and when i click again on this image it is going to hide so let's replicate this today okay so i have the two data sets production product and production transaction history so at first i'll add a, a chart uh, to show the data variation and i use the actual cost here so i have only one bar so let me go ahead and choose the name name of the product here so i can actually see some data variations here okay uh now let me add a card visual okay this is the visual on which the actions will be applied to show or hide the data on this card visual okay so for this i am going to choose actual cost to be shown okay so if i want to mask this data or hide this data i don't want to add any of any sort of data into the data set uh, which can be a problem in the actual calculations etc so what i do is i have a measure which i have already created it is a basic concatenation of rupee symbol and with few stars so you we will use this measure to hide this card visual let's see it in action okay for this i will copy paste the same card visual and remove the value so i know that it is in the same position as the previous card visual okay when i use this you can see here the data it looks like it is masked okay so let me get two images into power bi desktop here Uh, one for showing and one for hiding okay so let's go here i have this two images one is uh, the view one and the other one is the uh, is for hiding okay so these are too big let me resize okay i'll use okay this looks good okay i think this looks good i'll do the same thing for the other image as well okay so let me arrange this and give it a good look and i want to place this image the other image this image onto this image so let me get the position of this image and simply use that here okay so there is some issue here because it is a transparent image let me add the background to this image so that it will overlap on each other turn on the background and for this as well okay so this looks good now all right so let's capture some bookmarks for this canvas so bookmarks are like whatever is uh, in this canvas it will capture and store it for future use uh, like hiding or un unhiding the visuals we can do using bookmarks 
bookmarks have a lot of uh, different use cases we will get into those use cases uh, in future with some other videos so i'll quickly bring up the bookmarks menu and also i will bring up the selections menu so i can see what uh, layers we have and uh, uh, we can use that in the bookmark okay so if you see i already have two bookmarks which is used in this page right so uh, what i'll do is i'll create two more bookmarks to showcase okay let's hide these things first so we get to know we need to name them right unhide card and this would be for hiding so i name it as hide card okay so if i come here this is for leaving unhide image and this is for hiding so i name it as hide image okay so we have this i'll go and add a bookmark and i'll name this as hide one and uh, for this i need to have uh, i need to choose the image and the card that i need to show for hiding okay so this is hidden now that means if i click on this it should be unhidden okay i'll go and update this i'll add an, one more bookmark and rename to unhide one and it should be the reverse of this right now so i need to hide this and hide card okay and let's update the bookmark here so when you click on this image this is going to hide the values here okay so now we have the book bookmarks ready but this is not working yet well, we need to link the bookmarks to these images so what i do is i go to the hide image okay and action i turn on the action and type is bookmark hide one and i do the same thing for unhide image okay i go to the unhide image then action bookmark as type and unhide one all right so we have the images linked to the bookmarks let's see what happens in the power bi desktop you need to control click and uh, when you publish this to the power bi service you can just click directly so when i click on this i actually meant to hide it so this is hiding the data what is behind it and when i want to see the data i click on this image so it will unhide the image so this is how we use bookmarks to hide, hide and unhide the data or the visuals uh, on in power bi desktop i hope you like this video if you like the video give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel thanks for watching